I'm going to take outdated candles and turn them into holiday pillar candles. Stay tuned. and welcome back to my channel my name is Sharon if you're new to my channel hello and welcome and if you're returning thank you and welcome back I'm so glad you decided to share a little bit of your time with me here on creative glam I love to share videos on how I DIY beautiful and functional home decor while on a budget as well as travel paper crafts and food too so if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell hit the notification bell twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Today I'm participating in a collaboration and this collaboration is called Using Trash to Create Treasure. This collaboration is being hosted by Casey of Coffee with My Sunshine and April of April Adair Shares. They're both outstanding content creators here on YouTube. Um, I will leave a link to both of their channels down below in the description box. Make sure you stop by and check them out. I'll also leave a link to the playlist of all the other content creators participating in this collaboration as soon as that list becomes available. Now the details of this collaboration is that we are to take a, an item that we are about to purge, throw into the trash, or recycle and create something useful. Turn it into a treasure, upcycle, recycle, however you want to say it. So I've decided to create treasure out of some old pillar candles that I no longer use. I was going to throw them away, but decided that I'd upcycle them and turn them into holiday pillar candles. So let's get started. We're going to wrap these pillar candles with this paper. I found this paper at um, Joann Fabrics and I thought it went so beautifully. It's the mixed metals, the gold and the silver, and the pattern goes very well in my dining room. I've had these candles for quite a while and I was missing one so I had to buy the uh, the extra one to fill in the candelabra. But I'm going to cover these candles with this paper and um, and then I'm going to set them back in the candelabra. They will be strictly for show. Of course, they're not going to be to burn. I have plenty of candles to burn. These are just for decor purposes. I just think that's really pretty. It's super simple, a way to upcycle candles that you already have and um, do something new with them. So I'm going to just take the hot glue gun here and run a bead of glue up the paper. Okay. Now I'm just going to do one, two, three, four, five more. Okay, now I've got all seven candles covered with the first decorative paper. Now I have a second one that I'm going to make something like a belly band with the silver decorative paper uh, in keeping with the mixed metal theme. So uh, these sheets cost about $1.99 at uh, Join Fabrics. But I usually catch them when they're 50% off, plus I have a coupon. So I probably end up paying maybe about 60 cents per sheet. About an inch and a quarter. I'll do an inch and a quarter belly band on the smaller pillar candles. And I will do a two inch belly band on the larger candles. A little bigger than I wanted it to be. What do you think? Oh, I think I changed my plan right in mid. Mm. I think I like that better. I got these um, 
embellishments. What are they called? Adhesive gems. I got these adhesive gems from um, Hobby Lobby. I ordered them online. And um, I think that is beautiful. I think I just changed from that to that. Because this is a little large. I thought it was going to be the perfect size. What do you think? Should I go with the adhesive gem? Or should I go with the snowflake? Of course, I take it off the stick. That's the first one. And I'm gonna go ahead and put the gem on it too. I'm excited to use these. I've never used them before. Um, they are the glitter. They are gems with um, clear gems and pearls. This is the first one. I'll do it six more times. Thanks for tuning in guys. I hope you enjoyed my video. I certainly enjoyed using trash to create treasure. I think my holiday pillar candles came out absolutely beautiful. And if you do too, make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit the notification bell twice so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. And I upload new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Now if you look down below in the description box, you'll find the link to the content, you'll find the link to the playlist of all the other content creators participating in this collaboration. I want to thank Casey of Coffee with My Sunshine and April of April Adair Shares for inviting me to participate in their collaboration. I had lots of fun. And if you enjoyed it too, make sure you hit that subscribe button below. And with that being said, enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye!